All right, gotta wait. Uh, so I want to show you guys uh, again. Not sure you guys, but tell you guys again how they engage in sort of target and manipulation, harassment tactic. So my daughter had a trip today. She's in Beacon, and you have to sign her out. So you know her name was the only name that wasn't on the, the list that was there. So, you know, I just wanted to show you guys how they send these subliminal messages about targeting your kids. And so I took my phone out and then what they did is had one of the students uh, stopped in front of me, stepped in front of me, she had a black bag on. And they talk about how they use the color black, right? So, again, this is a, another form of them target and send a subliminal message by not having my daughter name on the list to sign her out I look at the purple right here yeah they, you know as i tell you they want to be on camera so bad yeah look into it yeah thank you um yeah so they want to be on camera so bad that this is what they do hold on a sec listen and then like i said try to engage in this sort of threat against your children right now also on top of that uh, when I was going to pick up, I left the house. I said to my son, uh, give me the house keys. So he steps towards me and he kicks his feet out. So I said, why'd you do that? And he goes, oh, it's momentum. I said, no, it's not momentum because I have always asked you to bring me the keys and you've never done that. So why are you doing that now? Right? So again, just to show you the sort of manipulation. And again, how they try to look at her. Look at them staring at my daughter. Look at these two grown ass women. I want you to understand the level of psychopathic and narcissism within the minds of these females that they engage in such behavior. Staring at my daughter, look, licking their, their, their lips and they're sticking out their tongue, right? Again, as to show you the homosexual, lesbian nature that I've been conditioned into a uh, woman. This is why I said the majority of kids that are uh, sexual abuse within the black community are done by women they are the victims of women uh, sexual assaulters right as well as physical abuse also but the narrative that the white media portray is that black men are solely respond are solely the ones that are doing these things but they are not it is the vast majority of black women but they are given the pass because of the narrative against black men and black boys. All right? So, again, like I said, they always show me these things and then, you know, again, they want to use the label, the crazy label, right, when it suits them. And that's fine. And that's fine because I know they haven't gotten any, everybody fooled. And that's why I continue to expose them in the way that I expose them. All right? So, talk to you guys in the next video.